Oh, yeah. Right. Mine didn't hit. I got mine. I had the big one hit me. <laughs> we'll get that big one, Ron. This is just a little guy. Oh, there he is. <laughs> All right, I'll let oh, this go. Oh, I lost him. No, I got him. You got him. That's still not the one I wanted. I'll let this guy go. Yeah. Still not the one I wanted. The one I wanted is probably about 10. Great start. What a way to get it going, bud. Oh yeah. Look at all the babies. Look at look at the minnows. There we go. Good one? Oh yeah. Oh, that's a better one. Nice, what, oh, maybe four or yeah. five pounder? What do we got here? Probably a five or six by the looks of it. Nice. Oh yeah. <laughs> this is a great way to start a day, oh, yeah. Ron. What, first cast, we each hit a fish. Double. Yours blows up. We got minnows, throw back and get babies them. and minnows <laughs> bouncing everywhere. I throw back, get this guy. Double header. <laughs> right off First cast. I, I had a big one blow up on this. And then we got a double header. I lost mine. You got yours. Throw right back and get another one. I'll tell you what, we are back at on the black water with a cute angling. Hi, welcome to the show. I'm Ron James. I'm Jeff Chisholm. We are here again in the Amazon. We're going to have a blast. It's shaping up to be one heck of a day. <laughs> if it stays like this, it'll be insane. <laughs> I am so looking forward to this. I'm loving this place. I just want a big one. Stick around. You don't want to miss this one. We're going to get them. Oh my, get him! Send him up, Utah. Oh, yeah! Another 20. Nice. <laughs> Ontario Toyota Dealers presents Fish TV. It's time to Toyota. With your hosts, Leo Stockos, Ron James, and Jeff Chisholm. Brought to you by Ontario Power Generation, powering Ontario's future. Rapala. Crafted from experience. Cabela's, world's foremost outfitter. And Fram, designed by experts, trusted by drivers. Come up, got him. Nice little two pounder. Little baby, that's all right. Along with that, I'll catch these all day too. You get a lot bigger than that. Oh yeah. <laughs> Makes it fun though, oh, constant yeah. action. Sweet. There he is. That's a better fish. Nice fish. There we go. Boy, nice. nice. There you go, five pounder. Yeah, I would say that one's maybe even six. Oh, maybe even seven. Six or seven, what'd you think? Where was he, in there? In that little gap? The tree on the right, very nice. nice Hold him up to show the camera. Six pounds. Six pounds. Beautiful. Great. On a jig. That's Great. beautiful. That spot in there just looks like peacock land right there. Oh yeah. You got a little cut in with some trees, lots of water around it. They can get in there, ambush points. You look for those and you'll catch fish on them. There he is. That's not a big fish. Oh, it's not him. There we go. Nice little peacock. Hey, Jeffrey. Even the little guys are, are colorful. It's quite special to be down here. 30 some degrees, catching fish like this all day long with some giants mixed in. And the boys back home are actually already ice fishing. <laughs> Shoveling snow, baby. Shoveling snow, and it's 30 some degrees down here. <laughs> I'd like to go right about now. Yeah, go out for an hour and then come back to this. Exactly. <laughs> you just go in an ice box for about an hour. There's one thing you don't do is fool around with the sun here. That's why I'm wearing this Rapala buff and just bundled right up. I got pants on. Normally you still see me in pants. I wear shorts in December. That looks like a big fish spot. Oh yeah. There's a fish. There you go. Good one. Three. Nice one. Yeah. Yeah. Butterfly. Ooh, down he goes. <laughs> dolphins got it. The dolphins got it. Oh, he's trying to get them. He's trying to get them. Dolphins right underneath them. Grab a hold. Bring him in. Oh, look out! The dolphin was right there. <laughs> oh yeah. See, the dolphin got his yeah. tail. Well, you see, you got to bring those little ones in. There he is, right there. Oh, there he is, right beside the boat. 
He's waiting for me to release this guy. So what we're gonna do is go yeah. to the bush. Yeah, yeah. So he has a fighting chance and the dolphin can't get him. All right, he'll be all right now. You know how shallow those dolphins can go? You had the big one. <laughs> nope. Nice peacock, though. Go get the big one, Ron. Try it. Nice. Sometimes you got to get these little guys out of the way first, and then the big guy will bite because they're a little faster. Beautiful. I'll let him go. A little one. Not big. Fish, though. Oh, the drone. <laughs> Where are you? Acrobatic guy. Oh, little guy. All right. They hit hard, though, eh? Oh, yeah. Like a rock. They rocket. do. You think you got a 10 pounder on it? It's like an eight pound smallie. Yeah. <laughs> That's what it feels like, doesn't it? The 10 pounders feel like a muskie or a Chinook. <laughs> yeah. Got him. Oh, yeah. Oh, I love it when they hit the top water, eh, Jeff? Oh, that's beautiful. <laughs> that is a beautiful thing. Nice oh, fish, yeah. Ron. Nice fish. Beautiful. I'm gonna get a picture of that one. Yep. Yeah. Very nice. Love the top water bite. I just had a feeling when we were coming in here. It looked right. I threw that <laughs> chopper. Maybe six, seven pounds, maybe? Six. That's what I thought. Beautiful. Thank you, sir. Look at that. That is just a nice explosion. Okay. All right, you're going. Thank you, sir. Nice. Woo, woo, woo. Boom. Wow. <laughs> There we go. Nice. That's behind it. There's a few of them there. That's a butterfly. Ooh, nice. Nice jump. <laughs> I got a, another bite in there. Watch this. I'm going to cast in there again. Get another one. Look at that. Butterfly. One, two, three. And the eye. It's now time for the Ontario Toyota Dealers Tackle Box. Okay guys, let's take a minute out of the action and show you exactly what we're using today. I'll tell you what, when you come to acute angling in the black water, you don't even need to bring your rods and reels, but I like bringing mine. This is a 13 fishing Fate Black 7 foot 1 medium heavy rod. Great for casting these wood choppers. These are fantastic top water baits that you use down here. I'm throwing it on an Inception 13 fishing reel with 70 pound Suffix 832 braid. That is a great topwater rod down here on the Blackwater. When you're throwing a jig, we're throwing that on an Omen Black 13 fishing rod with a Creed GT reel. This is a 6-2 to 1 spinning reel, so you catch up with the line really quick when you're, when you're twitching these baits. They make these right on the boat. It's got a rattle in it, a long tail. Great for when the water's high down here in the Amazon. If you bring this stuff with you to acute angling in the Blackwater, you're going to catch them just like we are right now. So let's get back to that fish TV action. Good fish, good fish. There you go, buddy. First cast, there you go. Not a bad fish. He hit like a freight train, though. I thought you had a big one <laughs> on there. <laughs> I love when they hit like that. Beauty. Nice. I thought it was like a nine the way it hit. <laughs> he hit like his four times that size. He thought he was a 20 pounder. Oh, wow. <laughs> All right, he can go to grow to one. That was a big fish, too. You got him, bud. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's the one I called out, I think, on the chopper. Oh, nice. He, that one followed my chopper out, I think. That's the same fish, right? And that's the nice. way you work. One, two, punch. Beautiful. Call him out with a chopper and then catch him with a jig. And nice bars. Look at that. Very good, buddy. Thank you. Let it go. <laughs> The guys that came with us on the trip. Great group of guys. I think every one of them's caught their biggest fish they've ever caught in their life. <laughs> Have a good look at the pictures here. You'll see some giant peacock bass.
Oh yeah. That's a good one. Gotta fight them out of the bushes. Dolphin or another fish behind it? Nice. Nice fish. Beauty. Oh, there's one following it too, bud. That's a beauty, that one. Nice one. Good. Yeah, they go straight for the bushes, and I, I thought I was actually going to have them oh, yeah. hang up in there. But we'll let them go. Watch the dolphin. Right. Awesome. Boy. Oh, Look at there's, there's a dolphin, a dolphin chasing right there him. chasing him. Got him. He got him. Oh, well. Dolphins got to eat too, I guess. Portions of Fish TV were brought to you by Mercury. Go boldly. Come on. And then he follows up with a jig and whacks a 20. There it is. You got him. Get him out of there, Jeff. Get him out of there, bud. Nice. <laughs> oh, good fish. Nice. <laughs> I called that one. <laughs> it's perfect. You, you throw the chopper in there and. You totally called that. I know, <laughs> like, I totally called it. And he throws it. the jig in and... It, <laughs> just wish it was a 20. It's a nice fish though. Good job. Can bring him right into you? Nice. Hold on, hold on, fish. Jig, yeah. Nice. Rifled it. That guy crushed it off the hook set. Yeah. <laughs> just peel drag. Beautiful colors wow. on that fish. Amazing. This is crazy fishing here. Still can't get one of those big ones to come up on a chopper. And gone. There he goes. Right off that point. Big trees. Yeah, that's the that's way the to do it. Recipe for peacocks. Need a chopper, man. Need a chopper bite. Yeah. I got I just got bit bite there. Good fish. Oh yeah. Nice rock. Yeah, a, oh, not as big as I thought. Still a decent fish. Watch that dolphin. That's a pretty good one. Oh, nice. nice jump. There we go. Watch that dolphin. Get it in here. Ooh, way. Four pound fish like that just feels like a tan. It's crazy. They all do. Eat it. Eat it. There we go. Now, I'm telling you, what is that fish? Five. Five pounder? Wow. Flat like a tan. Get in the trees. Oh, what is that? Oh. Big fish. <laughs> Rink boat side. Wow. Nice <laughs> fish, bud. Watch the dolphin. Oh, nice. Nice. The boga. Here, I'll bring him around this way. Wow. Nice <laughs> fish, bud. Oh, wow. That was cool. Right at the boat, I seen that. That was awesome. Crushed it right beside the boat. That's exactly where I got mine. <laughs> yeah. Same spot. But... Wow, that was awesome. Yeah. <laughs> That'll wake you up. <laughs> there you go. Another four and a half, four pounder. It's now time for the Garment Force Tip of the Week. When you're coming on a trip like this, you want to be prepared. There's a lot of different things that we brought on this trip to make sure that we were ready for the elements and the sun and the heat and all the different things you might well, face. Absolutely, you know, it's what, about 80 degrees, 85 degrees every day, but you notice that I am covered from yeah. head to toe, and that is huge. This sun will make you sick, will it not? It definitely will. Yeah, there's no doubt. So I wear fishing gloves, yep. full arm clothing, full pants, and a buff. These buffs are absolutely a lifesaver. You just pull them up like that, and you're completely covered. You even have a flap uh, hood on your and hat. And that works really well blocking your neck. Or that you can get the shirts like this that have the hood built right into them. I like that shirt. It's nice and light. It works well. Now, we're also in the rainforest and it will rain every single day. So a packable, lightweight rain jacket like Rapala's packable rain jacket, that's great to have as well. You know, when it does rain, it pours. Yeah. And you might get it for an hour, an hour and a half. But uh, communications is a big part here. And 
There is no, obviously no cell service, no nothing. What do you have got? I've got the Garmin InReach Mini here. This is a great device for satellite communication. It allows you to have a little SOS button if you have a problem or anything like that, but it allows you to just keep in touch with the outside world. We have one more thing we got to cover. We've got this Gamagatsu dry bag. It's great to put your extra clothes and anything like that in and keep them dry when it rains. That is a must. Definitely. And I'm Ron James. I'm Jeff Chisholm, and that's your tip of the week. Fish? Yeah, good fish. There you go. Oh. You got him out. Oh, that's a decent one. Nice. Nice. Oh. Yeah. Oh, another six pounder. Nice. Three more. That one is six pounds. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Yep. There we go. Look at it. The good thing when you come down here with the cute angling, you don't have to bring anything. They've got the rods, they've got the reels, they've got the bait. So all you gotta do is pack three sets of clothes because they do laundry every single day. So you don't need a big luggage, eh? No, it's great. Yeah. It's great. And there's so many other things to do down here. The other day we actually had a chance to stop and see a village, see how the people live here and, yeah. and uh, just experience what their life is here. Yeah. This is cashew. This is the nut. To eat the nut, it has to be cooked. This, the way how the fruit is here, you can eat it right away. Okay. Yeah, you just wash it and eat it. Okay, we go. This is a good fish, dude. Oh, nice fish, nice dude. Nice fish. Oh, look at this packer. Oh, yeah, that thing rocked it. I bet you I pulled him out of that tree up high, then I yep. slowed down and he hit it. I tell you what, I think that's a big one. You should see some of the fish we've caught on this trip, hey, Jeff? <laughs> oh, man. Oh, have a look at some of these giants. Oh, oh. nice five, buddy. <laughs> How you Dude. like that one, buddy? Dude! Yeah. <laughs> oh man! Yeah! Sebastian? Yeah, thank you. Oh, oh nice fish, nice. dude. Nice. <laughs> there, buddy. Oh, yeah. Nice fish. Woo. Look at how fat that thing is. Look at this. That is a good one right there. Look at that thing. Oh, hey, that's like fish. Yeah. That's another 18 pounder, buddy. <laughs> Look at that. Maybe four. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, <dude. laughs> oh. 77. That is unreal. <laughs> Oh, buddy! Oh, no, get him! Set the hook! He's on! Set the hook! He's on, he's on! Fish, fish! You're not gonna go in! Yeah. No, no, no! Oh, oh, watch that lure, watch that lure! Come on, Sebastian, you got this one. Where's the net? Okay. Yeah! Oh, my gosh! <laughs> Sebastian! 73. Crazy, man. It's a long six. You can just start to see the three bars coming through here now, but the dots all the way, 
Easy, easy. I'm going to let you go. I'm going to put you back in that bush because dolphins are around. I want to get a quick picture with this, Jeff. What happens is fish get tired. Dolphins have a hard time catching them when they're healthy. But once you play them, you get tired. So we bring them right back into the bush. That's just the way you do it right there. Well, there you have it, our trip to the Amazon aboard the Blackwater. What a pleasure it's been. You know what? This boat is has everything for you, doesn't it? Great accommodations, great meals. They treat you like amazing. The guides, <laughs> amazing, yeah, every one of them. Definitely. You really need to come down here, guys. Look at fishtv.tv and look under guiding services, and we'll show you exactly where we are. It's a, it's a trip of lifetime. It really yeah, is. Big yeah. peacocks, yeah. good times, yeah. good food. You don't want to miss it. Yeah. Until next week, I'm Ron James. I'm Jeff Chisholm. We'll see you next time right here on Fish TV. Bye-bye. Fish TV was brought to you by Lund, the ultimate fishing experience. Mercury, go boldly. And Hill Street Beverages.